Hello ladies and gentlemen, Hollow here. Yes, it's been a while, I know. I've had a lot going on in my life with the holidays and whatnot, but I am back and ready for some action, as I hope you guys are too. As you can tell, this is Destiny, and holy shit, what am I doing on this game? Well, I will tell you after taking a break, like some of my fellow content creators, I've decided to come back and mess around in Destiny with uh, a renewed sense of enjoyment in the sense that I don't really care about this game and PvP and like doing amazing and honestly I feel like that is really helped me enjoy the game a lot more um you're watching this gameplay right here I'm playing Sunsinger I haven't played Sunsinger in, since like year one and uh when everybody needed somebody to push Atheon off of uh the ledge in Vault of Glass so I've decided to try something new I'm using fusion grenades because I don't want to handicap myself so much. But after playing, you know, Blade Dancer and stuff and getting Shinobu's vows and then everybody using skip grenades and being killed by them is terrible. So I don't want to be a part of that problem. And I moved on to Void uh, Walker and, you know, Axions are just as strong. And I decided to uh, switch it up and do something new and try to enjoy the game. And honestly, Playing Sunsinger has given me a renewed sense of accomplishment when I I do well, and that's really nice. You know, I've been playing with new guns and stuff. I'm playing with Bad Juju here. I've also got the Matador on because I'm a piece of shit. I understand you can hate me. I hate myself deep down, but uh, it's just I, I can't believe that they don't nerf shotguns soon. So I'm just getting my, you know, my my time in with them. But speaking of nerfs and buffs and things of that nature, the Donning has just been announced. It is the new winter event. As you recall, in January, we had the Dawn of Dawning or something like that, where everybody got the Rising Light emblem if you played Destiny in a certain time frame. But now we have an actual event in the wintertime. And uh, yeah, it looks like there's going to be more microtransactions, but they seem to alleviate the pain of people being upset because they are allowing you to get one free treasure every day that you log on during the event. So that's kind of cool, I guess. Um, and SRL is back. Yay, I guess. You know, new gear, new weapons, new exotics. Finally, they're releasing the Void and Solar Thunderlord guns after showing them in the Taken King and, as, you know, whatever. Um... I decided to not care as much about missing content as opposed to the content that's already in the game. So, speaking of that, one of the main points of the December update is the fact that there's supposed to be weapon rebalancing for the Crucible. As you guys know, that's basically what I play. I enjoy the Crucible to a certain extent. I wish it was better in a lot of different ways, and hopefully with the rebalancing patch... We see some things change. Among those things are, I think the sniper should be brought back at least c close to where they used to be before that nerf absolutely made everybody use a shotgun in the Crucible. I think grenades need to be looked at, and that's mostly skip grenades. Mostly skip grenades, you know, Axion suck and stuff. You know, it really sucks when you die to grenades and especially when they're like initiation grenades like axion bolts and skip grenades and stuff like things you can't get away from that people just throw you know they always have two charges of them and stuff so it just sucks you know that's i i just hate dying to abilities 90 to 80 percent of the time instead of gunfights that blows in my opinion i also think primaries need to be looked at buffed they need to bring primaries back into a good place because they suck right now and there's really no incentive to use them if you have a matador and uh also like i said with the abilities and stuff it sucks also i think that they need to look at since the player pool is not as big as it used to be we all know this take out some of the game modes for pvp instead of splitting up the community so much and just have them rotate have like two weekly rotations of like mayhem clash and you know something else i don't know 3v3 i don't know but there's too many people playing different game modes and not enough people playing one game mode and i would be shocked to know what the actual numbers are of people playing at a single time in clash or control or something because i get placed against the same people and that might be skill-based matchmaking but 
I would like to think that there are more people out there on my skill level that I could play. But alas, that's not true. But with the dawning, I will be playing SRL. I will be uploading a lot more Destiny content for you guys. Hopefully it's good shit that you will all enjoy from the Primal Water Boy. And uh, hopefully we can get this channel back on track to where it needs to be. Um, I feel like there's a lot more content than what I expected in the dawning. That makes me semi-happy. I just hope that it's good content. And I am happy that they're leaving Sparrow Racing in. That's going to allow for the community to do other shit with it. You know, I'm definitely going to be on the GB ladders, you know, being a pro race car driver, you know. So, I'm, I'm, I guess I'm happy with that. At this point, I'm happy with whatever they give us in the sense that it's something new. But, alas, I don't think that uh, their main focus right now is on this Destiny. I think it's on Destiny 2, and I'm fine with that. I am fine with that. If you guys didn't check out um, the Game Battles Far Cog tournaments this weekend, they were pretty cool, I guess. It's nice to see Competitive Destiny actually doing something, LOL. And yeah, I will catch you guys in the next video. If you enjoyed this one, make sure you leave a like, comment down below if you want to argue with me. Uh, I know you guys have seen it on every other video, but YouTube has changed. It's a logarithm thing to uh, focus more on people who get likes and comments and interactions, so that's kind of shitty. Uh, the rich get richer and the poor get poor, but what can you do? I love every single one of you motherfuckers. Excuse my French. If you've stayed around, I appreciate it. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.